Hey, what is going on everyone? This is Wicked, where darkness is not really a solution for this tutorial. So let's turn on the lights. Okay, so in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to activate surround mode on the Galaxy S4 right here in my hands, my main device. And what do I mean by that? You will be able to listen to music, to listen to YouTube videos, um, you know, to stream music to your device with another speaker powered on this front speaker right here we're gonna be activating this in order to have a surround experience so the sound will come from here and from here so surround left and right so without further ado let's get into the PC and see what we have to do in order to activate it so uh, here we are on XDA Developers. This is a uh, mod made for i9-5505 device. Um, so for you guys who are asking in the comment section um, if it's working on another variant for the Galaxy S4, it does not. So this is only for this type, for the international variant. Um, uh, this is uh, not his work, so it's uh, his work. Um, make sure shout out to him. Um, so there are two files that you want to take into consideration while doing uh, this. The first one is uh, this file ending in Fusion 3 without any other, you know, fancy things and this is ending in aux pcm now you may want to check whether you have a touch with rom installed or a cm based rom because uh, we, they use different files so currently i'm running a touch with rom uh, um, kitkat 4.4.2 and the suitable uh, file for me is this one with uh, the extension called AUX PCM auxiliary PCM okay so in order to get the file all you have to do is to press to download this for the uh, touch with ROM or this for the AOSP when you download this you'll get two files the stock one and uh, the custom one so this also includes a uh, stock one um, so you, all you have to do is to get this one and put uh, on desktop if you're running AOSP or CM ROMs. Um, but if you're running like me, Touchways, all you have to do is to download this one, extract it into desktop, desktop and you'll have this file here. N right now, all you have to do is to connect your, your device to PC via an USB cable, as I'm doing right now. Unlock it in order to give permissions to the media media device i hope it will recognize it frankly no it doesn't um yeah it did actually so yeah this is the my uh, internal storage so we're gonna copy this to internal storage just uh, click and drag right now it's on internal storage so um let me let me switch to the device and let me put a tripod so you can see what I'm doing on the device. Talk amongst yourselves for a second. Okay guys, so after you put the file onto your internal, either internal or external SD card, all you need to have is a uh, file manager which will allow you to copy and paste the specific file. And, okay, I'm using Root Explorer and uh, of course you'll need root in order to make this work properly so make sure you go into system slash atc slash snd soc underscore msm so as i told you you'll need to flash the file actually flash copy and paste the file with uh, the aux pcm extension so it is called snd underscore sock underscore sme smm underscore uh, to 
x underscore fusion three underscore ox pcm so this is the file that you want to sorry not this one this one that you want to replace actually so we're going to be making a backup file and actually rename it okay granting root permission dot backup okay so right now we have a strong backup sorry for the banding in the background okay all in that all you have to do now is to get into your inst in internal storage and this is the file that you want to copy so we're gonna be copying it click this okay and get back into this window here and uh, simply paste it make sure you give the file the specified permissions you see here so read read none none read none, none. it should be what the fuck is going on okay so we have to deactivate set jit that's what we that's what was the problem okay so right now we have this file and afterwards you'll need to reboot your device in order to make it work okay click ok now my device is rebooting so I'll get back to you guys after to make a an audio test in order to make sure it works properly so talk amongst yourselves for a second okay guys so the thing is that it, it is actually really working it's not such a major difference but you will be able to see to hear it uh, for testing purposes I will uh, hide the speaker on the back with uh, my finger and then I'll put the microphone right here in order to hear it take a look at how beautiful it looks right now all plain black and white everything is um, I hope you can clear it uh, another so feature it is working about the settings is that everything is yeah, sure. And it's not this one because this Some one little details are shown here. So yeah, it's perfectly working, perfectly legit. And uh, yeah, that was it for today. And if you like it, if you did, please make sure you thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. This was Wicked. Bye bye.